guys welcome back to my channel my name is Miraja if you are new here please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video from me if you are new here welcome to the family and invite some other people to subscribe as well also leave me a comment share the video and like the video if you have a moment go ahead and follow me on Instagram as well at R I J I A H underscore B and this video is going to be a clean with me video um, I have been needing to clean and our house is it's not really you know that dirty often because it's just my husband and I and two dogs but sometimes I do procrastinate when I don't feel like it and this isn't even dirty um, but you know some little small things will aggravate you if you don't pick it up so I'm gonna go ahead and let y'all hang out with me and clean up my living room I do want to go ahead and share a little bit about the vacuum that I'm using which is the Bissell Adapt Ion Pet 2-in-1 Cordless Vacuum. Not really sure if this is the best vacuum out there but it is very convenient. The price is reasonable. Um, it's priced around $120. The on and off button is at the very top of the vacuum and then there's a brush button on the vacuum as well so that way you're able to use it. Um, and I should have shown you guys the button at the top. I forgot to. I'm still trying to get used to these reviews. Um, I use the brush when I'm on the carpet or the area rug, I guess I should say. And when I'm on hardwood, I would turn the brush off. The handle on the vacuum, it does collapse and it makes it easier for storage. There's Jack, y'all. <laughs> I gotta get my muse together. I know y'all like to listen to music when y'all clean. I gotta be hype. Here's the vacuum up close. Just wanna show you guys the hair and the lighting is pretty dark, but as you can see, it picks up really good on dog hair. Um, my dogs shed very, very bad in the wintertime, and so this vacuum is awesome for that, so that way you can get all the hair up. And you can see, it's like dirt, dust, hair, all kind of stuff in there. And that's probably about a week or a week's buildup. You can also use the trigger to fold the vacuum so that it's easier to get in hard to reach places. And I should have showed you guys that as well. Um, the vacuum is great for picking up dust and pet hair, but it does not like to pick up anything large, which is a huge downfall to me. Um, the brush just doesn't seem strong enough to use on thick carpet or long pile carpet. Um, you can get the hand vacuum out as well, which you've seen that I did. I just clicked it and took it off so I can get the couch and make sure I get the couch um, cleaned. It's very easy to use on wood floors, laminate floors, tile, and any hard surface. It's great for easy pickup, but it isn't a main vacuum where you can use to actually deep clean the carpet or whatever you're needing to do to get your carpet clean. It's more of a let me use this to just pick up hair or dust or dog hair. I also think the charging on this vacuum is horrible. I hate the battery life on it, it sucks. And I haven't found a battery indicator that shows the battery life on it. So the vacuum just blinks red when it's about to die. And um, mine does that very often after charging fully. So I don't know if I just got a bad vacuum or what. But the battery life sucks. It can charge like for 8 hours. And I promise you it feels like I haven't even used it for 45 minutes and it's already dying. Um, it is convenient though to have since it's a cordless vacuum. I do love it for my pets, but I'm just not really a huge fan of it. Um, it's not really the best quality to me. I mean, for the price, it's good. Um, my personal, I guess, choice for the vacuum would be the Bissell Crossway that I'm really, really dying to try. So I want to get that so I can make a review on that one. But if you're just looking for an easy pick-me-up, you know, small area rug or hardwood floors or whatnot this is a great vacuum for you um, but other than that it's not really just a long term durable vacuum in my eyes now we're in the bedroom and we've been in here for a little while I'm just trying to make sure I told you guys everything about the vacuum yes I know my room is dirty <laughs> so that's the whole reason of the video and trying to clean it up um, we're just gonna fold clothes and fix my closet or our closet and get a little bit more organized We're still trying to get settled and you know get our room and everything together. So eventually I would do a 
um, room makeover so that way you guys can see it from beginning to finish or beginning to end and see the finished look of it because we're still trying to get it together if you have not checked out my new video or the video that I just posted of the living room makeover you should definitely go check it out my sister and my mom redid my living room and it looks amazing compared to <laughs> what it first looked like so you guys should go check out that video and see my amazing living room this closet was such a hassle and y'all we still trying to get settled and moved in so everything is just everywhere and i have so much freaking stuff like it doesn't matter how much stuff i give away how many times i go through my clothes and clear it out and give them away it's like clothes just find me and they come back <laughs> and I can't never get rid of them and Anthony's always on me saying I have too much I have too much and it's like I go through it so frequently but I just can't get rid of it <laughs> it's like more clothes come and come and come so we are going through and just straightening my shoes that whole shoe rack up there is just all of my shoes like it's ridiculous and then I have shoes and bins I have two bins <laughs> full of shoes it's just crazy I have to I have to find some time to go through some more of this stuff. So this is our walk-in closet and we're trying to share the space, but it doesn't like it's gonna happen <laughs> because I have too much stuff and it's very sad. All right, y'all, so we are fixing the top of the closet still. Anthony is moving the shoes and trying to get them straight and putting all the tennis shoes in one place, all the heels in one place, all my boots in one place, trying to make it easier for me. You'll get to see um, that it looks a little better. I didn't get a full um, video or I guess shot of the finished look of the closet, but you can see it looks way cleaner. Um, we still have a lot to do, but that's all I have for the video, y'all. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Peace.